the stream lead and that is really important like suppose you are creating a dashboard or something else so we need line chart also okay so let's see how can build a line chart uh, let's see the code first see, here you can see uh, i'm like just a minute yeah so i'm importing streamlit so import streamlit as st then i'm importing pandas import pandas as pd then here you can see this particular directory i have a one uh, csv file that is called data one dot csv so i want to read this file so data one dot csv i'm reading using pandas pd dot read underscore csv let's do one thing let's first uh, uh, write this so see how can we show the data in uh, uh, in uh, stream it so there are different different method to show this uh, so and even i will create uh, one um, session on that also but in this particular session let me use one that is called write so i'm writing st dot write data dot head so i'm reading this data one dot csp and let me show this data in stream it so let me run this particular thing so let's run it here in terminal at i am writing this uh, so how can uh, run a streamlit you know so file uh, for python file just write streamlit run and then your file name so here you can see my file name is line uh, underscore chart dot py now hit it Here you can see uh, we got this output. Just a minute. Uh, see, so if you see this, uh, we are able to uh, hit this import streamlit as st, then import uh, pandas. I'm reading this data and let me show this data. Okay. So here you can see I, I have this data uh, like week, prod A, prod B and prod C. So week means we have week number and prod A means uh, product A, product B and product C. So these are the weekly sales basically, prod A, weekly sales, prod B, weekly sales. So I, if you want to see the data here, you can see the data. So if you want to uh, hold data, just write st dot this, don't write head. And now if you write st dot write data, now let me save this now if you check the result here just see let me write this so here you can see i have this data so i have weekly data so we have total uh 15 week and for which week you have a prod a prod b prod b sales data okay anyway so let me make it like data dot head here so we'll have less data anyway now let me save it so if you check here now we can see this i want to make a you know line chart line graph so but i don't want for week i want only prod a prod b prod c so i'm just using here you can see pandas technique using ilog i just want to remove first column even if you want to check check this like this st dot write and write again data dot head so yeah let me save it uh, see the output now you can see in this particular data we don't have week because i want to remove this week i only want prod a prod b prod c data weekly sales data so see i just removed this particular uh, column using iloc now i want to plot line uh, chart for this data so just write very simple command st dot line chart and give the data let me save it see the result here so we have this result for prod a prod b prod c so prod a basically this color prod b this color prod c color. so we can compare this here you are able to see the graph so making this line graph in this streamlet it's very simple but very very useful if you are going to compare with all three product we are just able to compare with weekly here we can see even in week like in first week which is dominating with second which which is dominating so even you can see in 14 week prod c is like dominating all the products so we can uh, compare the sales weekly sales using this line graph that's why very very important in it okay so and even all the graph was really really important so we will come in uh, classes we will see a different different graph how can you do in stream because those are very very important if you are trying to make a dashboard okay 
so i believe you guys are able to understand this thank you so much in next section we will do more uh, different different things thank you so much